This morning, the governments of Canada and Nova Scotia are jointly announcing a number of important nature protection measures, including our shared commitment to deliver a federal provincial nature agreement by 2023. This includes initiatives such as exploring the proposal of a new national urban park at Blue Mountain Bridge Gold Lakes, with key partners such as the Halifax Regional Municipality, the Nova Scotia Nature Trust, and the Nova Scotia Mi'kmaq. Work towards the establishment of a newly proposed Atlantic Archipelago National Wildlife Area, as well as three other proposed national wildlife areas, and exploring the creation of new ecological corridors that connect natural spaces and help species and ecosystem adapt to climate change. And lastly, develop, developing a funding agreement to conserve old growth forests and address the invasive species hemlock woolly adelgae with a commitment from the federal government to commit up to $10 million. Today's commitments represent a major step forward for the protection of nature in Nova Scotia. By conserving nature, we are protecting the most beautiful parts of this province, so valued by communities rich with diverse species and wildlife. And we're strengthening the capacity of our natural world to fight climate change and keep our air and waters clean and healthy. I would like to congratulate Nova Scotia on your target to protect 20% of land and waters in the province by 2025. Furthermore, your support for our federal goal of 25% by 2025 nationwide is greatly appreciated. This is something we are hoping all provinces and territories can rally behind.